Thank you, nice to be back. Over the moon. It's been it's been too long. Order cat! Plus you wanted a big diamond. So there it is. I'm excited that the Border Cats are back after four years. Border Cats fans for ooh, probably as long as we can remember. My first game was 2007. So, you know, we're excited to see the team back. It's been about three years too late. Thunder Bay legend, if you will, Jack Pino, uh, will be starting on the mound. So we're pretty excited about that. I think he's, uh, you know, it's got nothing to do with, it's got a little bit to do with him being from Thunder Bay, but he's been a really good arm. He threw already one outing and was really good for us, so I'm excited to have him. Thunder Bay, Ontario, and I started off playing for the Thunder Bay Lakers in town here and had a couple of great experiences. Uh, in the Little League 2, playing for part of the Nationals, we went pretty far. Came third in Nationals one year. And then I kind of, um, things didn't really work out in town here, so I had to go and play for the Toronto Mets down there. Played there for quite a few years, ended up making the Junior National team. Was really fortunate to do that for two years. Um, then this past uh, spring, I was just in North Carolina playing for Pro 5 Academy play against some really good competition down there um, and then now I'm getting uh, ready to go to Creighton uh, kind of middle of August so this is this definitely the best place I can be. It's great for the Border Cats, it's great for the Thunder Bay Lakers, I mean great minor league organization, I think they have to get all the praise here in this situation and I think Pino's going to do great tonight, we'll see. I kind of made it known that I wanted to play here, this is a super good league. Um, and especially just playing for your hometown, nothing beats that. David Pino uh, here at the Border Cats game, watching the first game and uh, enjoying my son pitching first time at home in a long time. How does it make you feel to be uh, watching your son out there play ball? Uh, pretty proud. It's been a long journey, a lot of sacrifice on his part, and uh, just nice that he's got to uh, pitch at home in front of all his family and friends. This is really just a culmination of a great journey and you know, more about showing what he can do. So whatever happens here, we're just proud of him. And uh, yeah, he's got a long career ahead of him. There's been quite a bit of buzz around the, the city. So, I mean, it's just the start of the season. We're kind of still getting to know each other. So I think we're going to win a lot of games here. It's exciting. Uh, again, baseball hasn't been played here in, I believe, 1,393 days. And so, for us to get a ball club back here and uh, you know be able to compete at a high level is really important, and, and I look forward to that. And I look forward to you know hopefully putting on a good show for these fans.